Welcome to today's episode of AJY. AJ's YouTube. Bam! Fresh off a birthday week. I had a great birthday week, actually. Wasn't even a birthday. I had a, had a birthday, then I had a day after my birthday, then I had a birthday weekend. Oh, it was super awesome. Went to a comedy club, even got to get on stage. That shit was incredible. Uh, lots of good fun. Went to the casino. Ate out a bunch of places. Blah, blah, blah. I had a really great birthday. And then... I won the tournament, Sunday's Locals. I won that. I beat Sword Soul, I beat some Mermails, uh, and now I got some Burst of Destiny and some OTS to open for today. My Lyralist Tri-Brigade deck is doing quite great. Once again, I'll say it again, I'm going to Vegas in February for the YCS. Let me know if you're going. All right, in the name of Yugi, Kaba, hold the cards, stop for the do, bye bye, amen. Let's try to get some sword soul stuff, because that's what we need. Flip Frozen, Blunderese, Heavy Interlock. I, uh,. I haven't pulled a Starlight in a really long time. Let's see, how many? I've pulled like three or four in my whole life. It would be nice to pull another one. What is this? Heavy V Trooper, Mighty Neptune. Shuffling three, banished into the main deck. But how, what banishes V Troopers? What is this? If this card is sent from the deck to your graveyard by a monster effect, you can special summon this card. Then if you control a plant monster, you can have the attack and defense of one monster in the field. You can only use two effect monster turn. Only that turn, if this card would be destroyed, you can send a plant monster from your deck to the graveyard instead. Oh, I get it. I get it. It's not horrible. I mean, it is a plant tuner, so. And it's a level one. It's a plant tuner level one. Like, it's it's got a lot going for it. And when it gets destroyed, it just brings out another one. Magic key. Okay, this one upside down for some reason. Upside down. Burst of Destiny. Brothers of Legend. We got the maximum gold. How come it seems like every time I'm like, oh yeah, this is gonna be like the greatest set ever. Like almost immediately after. I think that. They come out with some news, like, Brothers of Legend is gonna be through the roof, man. Realistically, like, Brothers of Legend is gonna be insane. Oh, you know what, I think I didn't do another one of the, well, I only have two, I don't know what the ratios are, but it's nice to grab another one of them. Yeah, I don't know, man, it's ridiculous. What's the other one? Chaos, something chaos. Battle of chaos. Battle of chaos supposed to have good stuff. Brothers of Legend supposed to have good stuff. Do wonderies. All right, so far, very not exciting. Can't all be winners though, I suppose. Still, no. Where are some, like, good secret rares? I need, like, Ecclesia or that secret rare of Sword Soul. And then this would, like, all be worthwhile. Double Disruptor. I don't even know. 
Once per turn, when your cyber monster declares an attack, you can discard. Mm. Yeah, no thanks. <clears throat> B Trooper Descent. Special summon a B Trooper token. And if you control an insect with 3,000 or more, you can destroy. Hmm. Be kind of cool if that was a quick play. I don't know if I knew about that already. I mean, you get a token. Which can't go wrong with a token, right? Sword Souls, Sacred Summit. I have two of them already. I don't think I will play three, right? Because it's like a monster reborn. You can only use it once per turn. So why would you want to play more than one of that? Just play one monster reborn, play one of them, call it a day. All right, last one. Small world. Well, you know what? Considering that I ordered my three already, um, I think when I ordered mine, they were like 25 a piece. They were either 25 or they were 30. So I definitely spent a good chunk of money on getting them, but pulled my own. So I can just put one of the ones that I get sent uh, in the trade binder. Small world, though. What a crazy card, man. I did not actually, when I read this card, I didn't like it. I was like, screw all that mess, you know? Why am I going to go through all that? Reveal, choose, banish, blah, blah, blah. You know. Then add from the deck one monster exactly. Hold on. So, choose a monster from the deck. Banish the revealed monster from your hand. Add a monster from the deck to the hand. And banish the card chosen from the deck. So you're banishing two. One from your hand, one from your deck, and then you're getting one. I don't know. Just seems a little uh, much. But then I realize that the card that you're going to get to your hand could shut your opponent's entire, you know, turn down. Like, oh, small world, I'm going to go grab Droll. Banish this, banish that. Got Droll to my hand. Um... You know, sucks to be you. It's pretty nuts. Or even Lancia. Add, add Lancia. Shut that opponent's turn down. Alright, where did I get this from? Probably not there. Nope, came from this side. Whatever. Alright, let's open these OTS. Oh my god. What is it though? Oh, okay. Well, that's Utopia. It's like the worst one, but I still wanted one. So I guess I got my wish. Got myself a Utopia. Hmm. Well, we still got two more to go, so let's keep going. Okay, painful decision. Insector, flawless perfection. It's nice to actually grab another one of these because I was running two of them in my Tenyi deck, so if I'm gonna run Tenyi Sword Soul and I do wanna run, you know, I doubt I'm gonna run a two probably, but either way, it's, I'm happy grabbing that one. Now I know that they're all hollows, so. Okay, painful. Number C, Power Bond. All right. It's cool, Power Bond was a nice reprint. <clears throat> Alright, well, 
That's gonna be the video. Small World and Utopia. It's probably the two really cool ones out of today's video. Pull an ulti, pull a secret rare, call it a night. And two ultras, got the bee trooper and the, where's the other one? Oh, oh, they're both bee trooper. How about that? All right, peace out of here. That's another thing too. I kind of want to keep a bunch of these sealed because OTS 17, 17 is my birthday number. It's pretty dope, man. All right. Thanks for liking, commenting, subscribing, all the other great stuff. The channel don't exist without you guys, really, because if nobody watched these, I wouldn't put them up anymore. What would be the point? But it's fun, and uh, hell, I don't even think I'd be going to a YCS if it weren't for this channel, realistically. I wouldn't have took it uh, as far as I did. So definitely going to have to record all that shit. We're going to have to make like a series, going to YCS Vegas, with AJ's Yugi Tube, you know, pull up some popcorn, enjoy. That's gonna be fun. Can't wait for all that. Later.